Hey everyone! Good morning! This is Rachel and welcome back again to Samsung Tribe video blog. Today is March 12 and it's the 10th appointment of baby Samson to the hospital. But today's video, it will be only with the broodbrow. Broodbrow is midwife, so I cannot be uh, seen by the doctor, but it's only appointment with the midwife. And then we will see what uh, questions we're gonna ask to her. If I have a lot of questions, the doctor said, and then the midwife will answer all of that. So we'll see you in the hospital and I hope that we're gonna see baby Samson's position too if she's already in the right position or bridge position. So we'll see about that later. Stay tuned! langs deze kant, mm -hmm. de linkerkant, dan gaan we hier armen en benen, maar dat is allemaal niet meer zo duidelijk, want we krijgen die niet meer op het scherm van de normale. Okay. En al het zwarte is vruchtwater. Ja, vruchtwater. Ja. In de moederkoek. Ik kan dat moeilijk zien, nee. dat is voor de gynaecoloog. <laughs> ja, maar het is echt voor Maar het hoofdje zit mooi onderaan. Boven, zeker. Zat hij van boven? Ga ik kijken wat ik dat kan zien. Ga ik ja, ik kan het niet met zekerheid zeggen, maar of de gynaecoloog zegt bovenaan zal het bovenaan zijn. Okay. Maar haar positie is in goede. Heel goed. Ja, dankjewel. So finally guys, that's all the video for today. And you've seen the 10th echo of uh, baby Samson. But the midwife uh, didn't know about the placenta if it's above because she said you can ask the doctor but the doctor told me it's already in, in above of my stomach, my belly. And I asked her about breastfeeding and normal delivery, cesarean, what are the things that I need to take to the hospital, what is not needed and for the baby, for my uh, mommy bags, and for epidurals and cesarean and other stuff. So for that video, you've seen baby Samson position. Uh, the midwife look, look at her in the echo and she said everything is okay. And she was, her head is down already in the right position. So nothing to worry about and she gave me these three booklets befalling giving birth in the hospital and epidural vervaudi is the anesthesia for your spinal cord and cases nade is the cesarean section so i need to read all of this this one is about the information the bevalin giving birth at the hospital, all about uh, normal delivery, breastfeeding, and other stuff. Kaiser's Neda about cesarean section, you need to know. And at the back of it, uh, there's a lot of more information after the operation. And the operation and anesthesia. 
but this epidural I need to sign informed consent here and it is look like this so they gonna if I do cesarean or normal you can ask for epidural in here so it's anesthesia they will inject you at the back of your spinal cord so you don't uh, feel uh, the pain so that's I didn't know they, they do that also for normal delivery but you can ask for it but you need to sign it if you're not agreeing you can sign it and then don't submit it but they said uh, if you want anytime sign it and then if in case you need it in emergency then just give it to the doctor so that's it for now so for the midwife appointment that's all we did for the day and i'm gonna be in the last two weeks now so we'll see on the next appointment by the doctor on march 19 so see you next time bye